Dupuytren's contractor is a genetic disease affecting hands and causing an inability to extend the joints freely. It appears as a scar-like thickening of the skin in the palm of the hands, often extending into the fingers. The disease is progressive and at some point may cause significant issues with hand function, thus reducing quality of life. They complain that they're unable to put their hand down flat on a table or another flat surface. And then as the disease progresses, they have difficulty putting their gloves on. Ils ont des difficultés à taper à l'ordinateur, prendre des objets de gros calibre parce que les doigts ne vont pas ouvrir à ce niveau-là. Currently, the standard of care is open hand surgery, which is effective but can involve a lengthy recovery. Well, basically my hands started bending so until they were like claws almost and I couldn't hold things, I couldn't put my hands down straight, I had trouble writing, etc. It was a major, you know, surgery in an operating room, and it was wrapped up, and I couldn't use it for at least six to eight weeks afterwards. Les patients souvent ne peuvent pas retourner travailler immédiatement parce qu'il faut s'occuper d'une incision. La thérapie euh, suite à une opération du stupidrain peut durer jusqu'à six mois dans certains cas. J'étais au courant que la maladie du stupidrain existait, Euh, et à un moment donné, je me suis aperçu que le petit doigt commençait à accrocher. J'étais voir un, un médecin, un plasticien, puis on m'a opéré euh, de façon traditionnelle. On peut pas rien faire avec la main. On apprend à prendre sa douche, avec à faire des, des passe-passe avec la main gauche. Less invasive procedures, such as releasing the tissues with a sharp needle, can be effective, but hold a high recurrence rate. Up until now, non-surgical options have proven not to be effective. However, there's now a new option called Zyaflex, which treats the symptoms of Dupuytren's contractor non-surgically and effectively. Most adult patients with a cord that can be felt are good candidates for the treatment. J'ai des amis qui ont du Dupuytren, puis je leur ai suggéré de jamais passer à travers une opération invasive. C'est 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 vraiment désagréable. It was uh, a miracle drug in the sense that it worked, there was no effects afterwards, no recovery, no pain. And if I hadn't known that was, that's what it was, you would never know what happened. I was back at work the afternoon where the, where the drug was put in. Zyaflex is an enzyme that breaks down the scar-like cords that cause joint contractor. It is injected into the hand by a treating physician as an office-based procedure. The physician will complete treatment a few days later by manipulating the hand and releasing the injected cord. Most patients require only one or two injection procedures to achieve optimal results. After the Zyaflex procedure is done, all they require normally is one or two visits to the therapist to have the custom fabricated splint. Oftentimes there's no open wound, so they have no dressing, so they can return to their normal activities, work, leisure activities, the next day or two days after. J'ai remarqué que les patients n'ont presque pas de d'incapacité suite à, à, à cette procédure-là. Alors c'est vraiment une grosse différence euh, quand on compare l'injection et la chirurgie ouverte. If you or someone you know suffers from Dupuytren's disease, speak to your doctor to find out more about Zyaflex and see if this treatment is right for you. Une chose est sûre que si n'importe qui qui peut éviter une opération majeure, s'ils sont pas convaincus, ils ont juste à m'appeler, je vais leur dire qu'est-ce que c'est.